Hey loves, welcome to or back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Evita and on my channel, I like to post videos about my budget, my journey to becoming debt free and also cash stuff in videos. If that sounds like something you'll be interested in, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you find yourself enjoying today's video, then go ahead and give it a thumbs up. But in today's video, I am going to get you all caught up with my July budget. If you didn't know, I am still recovering from COVID. It, it, it was horrible. That's all I'm going to say. I went to Costa Rica and came back with COVID. 14 of us went and seven of us came back with it. It's, 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 uh, it was absolutely horrible. You guys absolutely horrible. I still don't have like a ton of energy and yeah, if you can, you might hear it in my voice if you watch my, a lot of my videos, but I'm so sorry for the way I sound, but I feel fine. It's just that I still have a cough and I, my voice, my voice is just still crazy. Uh, all right. So let's go ahead and check in. So paycheck one. Uh, budgeted 15 got 16 16 all right like I was saying I do get paid this week we'll see how much that check is gonna be I did have a rollover of seven hundred and one dollars and I had I emptied my twenty dollar savings challenge it had two hundred dollars in it so that actually came out as well I did go ahead and stuff my uh, some of my envelopes with that two hundred dollars I only uh, stuffed a hundred of it and I'm gonna save the other hundred for this month's cash stuffing so I've paid my rent I have paid ID protect I paid car wash credit monitoring Josiah's phone internet and the I haven't paid the car insurance or the electric now this month July is Naya's month to pay Naya is my daughter she's an adult she has a job and she still lives with us but we go every other month we pay we are alternate pay, alternate paying so she pays the odd months and i pay the even months so like i said i don't know how, well, you know it isn't gonna be 250 but if she can't pay the electric bill i always budget for it just in case she cannot pay it which you know you never know someone's situation but that's all for that we're all caught up on that so capital one so far i have paid 396 dollars which is half of the 792 so i could write that in there access one i i thought it was 380 i don't know if they changed it you know these companies do what they want to please but it said the minimum due was 329 so guess what i paid 329 <laughs> i'm focused on getting this paid off and then i'm going to go ahead and focus on actually getting this paid off and this isn't the amount that i owe you guys know that i always put whatever they have but that is before interest has accrued and everything so i am going to go ahead and erase this and put the actual amount so i don't know where i get 7022 from yeah i wish it is eight thousand one hundred and seventy six dollars honestly i don't know where i got that seven thousand from like, I don't even think I had 7000 in the month. Yeah, I don't know where I got that from. I was tripping. <laughs> Wishful thinking, I guess. Wishful thinking. But this doesn't come out until like the 21st. So that hasn't been paid. And actually, AMR, I received an email from them today. That came out today. I already paid UMC $100. That's due at the beginning of every month. Now on to my bank sinking funds. I already put 75 into gifts, 20 into kids, travel, already got 25, emergency and house got 100, and then fun and auto also got 25. I do have another $25 coming out this paycheck, so I'm going to just hold off on actually adding those up together. And I have not stuffed any of my envelopes for the month of July yet. I will be stuffing them with this upcoming paycheck. So I guess that is all for today's video. All right. So if you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye.